Good afternoon, Calvary Moravian Church. This is Pastor Janelle. I'm not quite sure how to film this so that you can see me too. Let's take a quick, quick look. Hi. As you can see, I'm here at Calvary Moravian Church on Monday, March 30th, socially distanced, but here to walk you through the daily text for today, as well as some of the upcoming opportunities for worship, including our readings for Holy Week, our beloved Palm Sunday service, and of course, what is coming up on Easter. Our Moravian daily texts for today are as follows. From the prophet Jeremiah, when people fall, do they not get up again? If they go astray, do they not turn back? And Jesus said, from the Gospel of John, chapter 6, verse 37, Anyone who comes to me, I will never drive away. When I read those words this morning, I thought of both the prophet's words and Jesus' words, of a reassurance that in a season and in a time of finite disappointments, of uncertainties and anxieties, that we have been promised these words and these opportunities for infinite hope. People will get up again. We will gather again as a community. Someday, and I'm not going to predict when, but someday soon, in finite time, these pews will be filled again. Until then, know that you are in all my prayers, and I'm so grateful for the people who have been able to connect virtually via Zoom or Facebook live streaming, or perhaps on your phone of dialing in and those numbers that we provided. I'm so grateful for the phone calls I have had, and I'm looking forward to talking with even more of you via phone, letter, uh, and it's been great to wave to some people from afar. Just a few hours ago, I had the opportunity to record our organist, Ann Edinger, again, keeping a good social distance, but to record her playing some of our beloved hymns for Palm Sunday for Holy Week, and later on, we'll record some for Easter. Those hymns will be part of a YouTube series as well as shared via our Zoom capacities. And so now let me explain a little bit more about what will happen during these next weeks. Please join us for worship on Sunday, April 5th, as we gather for our Palm Sunday worship. This will be filled with the music that we've come to expect from Palm Sunday, our hosannas, <clears throat> our ride on, ride on in majesty, and other selections. We'll have a message and we'll do all of this via Zoom and via Facebook live streaming, which you can access and it'll be recorded for access at any time. Now, let me explain about some of the other opportunities since I have you on this walk. Let's go outside for a minute. Got my keys? Okay. You probably know all about our free little library. Wonderful resource for our community and our friends and us to share books and other resources. However, at this time, we're also looking forward to allowing the free little library to be a place that we can share our worship bulletins. So starting this Friday and every Friday in the month of April, if you come and open the free little library, on the very top shelf we'll have a bulletin and my message for that Sunday stuck inside. You can take those bulletins home and enjoy the back cover reflections and also enjoy what is printed there inside for you. It'll be a way that perhaps even if you're not able to get on to our Zoom or our Facebook you're able to connect with us in worship and worship in your own home. Of course, the, lo the lower part of our little library will certainly be filled with books and other resources as well for our community to pick up and continue to enjoy. 
We hope that you can continue to worship with us through Palm Sunday into the events of Holy Week. The events of Holy Week we have planned to broadcast on YouTube and again to share on Facebook. We'll be sending out those links to everyone via our congregational email and they are also available in our print newsletter which is coming out this week shortly. Each day of Holy Week from Sunday evening, Monday evening, Tuesday and Wednesday evenings will be broadcast via the YouTube channel that we'll be creating. We'll have favorite Lenten and Holy Week hymns. We'll have some of the readings from our Holy Week manual. And then on Thursday evening, we'll be together for a YouTube uh, time, again, on Zoom and on Facebook to celebrate a virtual Holy Communion, to come together with your bread and your drink, be it wine or grape juice. And consecration will happen as we are together and I am blessing those elements. Friday, we'll have our Good Friday service at two o'clock, a Zoom service again. We'll have a pre-recorded Tenebrae via our YouTube channel. Sunrise and Easter celebration will both be shown on our Zoom and our Facebook. All this information is inside of our newsletter, but allow this to be a reminder that our church is still connected, is still open. And even as we are distanced from ourselves physically, we are still a faith community in spirit and in God's peace. So brothers and sisters, know that we miss you all. We're looking forward to being able to see you face to face. And in the meantime, allow the promise of God's love and God's grace and God's infinite hope in all seasons to rest upon you. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious unto you. May the Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.